Morocco made history on their Women's World Cup debut by reaching the last 16 after a hard-fought victory over Colombia, even though the South Americans progressed as Group H winners. Morocco's passage to the knockout rounds came thanks to Germany's failure to beat South Korea, allowing the debutantes to secure second place in the group. Anissa Lomery's goal, a rebound from a saved penalty by captain Ghislaine Chebuk, proved to be the decisive moment in the match. Reynaud Pedro's side showed immense progress since their 6-0 defeat to Germany in the opener. They put in impressive performances against South Korea and Colombia, showcasing their potential on the global stage. With two victories under their belt, they advanced to the last 16 and etched their name in Women's World Cup history. Morocco started the match brightly, with Ibtissam Drady forcing a save from Colombia's goalkeeper Catalina Perez in the early minutes. Chebek nearly caught the keeper off guard with a well-worked corner, showing the Moroccan side's intent to attack. Their persistence paid off when Drady was fouled in the area, leading to Chebek's penalty being saved, but Lomery pounced on the rebound to give Morocco the lead. As Germany's quest for a winner against South Korea ended in a draw, Morocco's defense held firm to secure their place in the knockout rounds, a remarkable and unexpected achievement. Notably, Morocco's men's team also achieved a historic football milestone by becoming the first African side to reach a World Cup semi-final in 2022. Now, the women's team adds another historic achievement to the country's football legacy. Meanwhile, despite a muted attacking performance, Colombia secured the top spot in Group H. Their strong starting 11, featuring four players one yellow card away from suspension, lacked the usual attacking flair shown in their previous matches. Star winger Linda Caicedo was mostly anonymous in this encounter. Although Colombia improved in the second half, they couldn't find the breakthrough they needed against Morocco's solid defense. Manager Nelson Abadia's side must regain their attacking verve in the knockout stage, especially with fullback Manuela Venegas suspended for the next match. With England looming as a possible opponent in the quarterfinals, Colombia needs to rediscover their attacking prowess to continue their successful run in the Women's World Cup. Don't miss the thrilling highlights from this action-packed encounter. Subscribe and stay tuned for more exhilarating matches and surprises.